Welcome to Maroon Lust Part 17. And in this one, we are finally on vacation. Yes, summer vacation. This is going to be an awesome week. Now, we just got to get through, like, the intro of summer vacation. So far, you got, you got lucky. Well, where's lucky? I see Chancellor. Uh, we're going to have lucky talk to Chancellor. And, because she hasn't seen Chancellor in a while. I mean, if, um, well, they live about three hours apart, so... By the time she gets to catch up with her, catch up with her aunt. Yeah, I built this lodge based on the lodging section at uh, the Penny Rile Forest Lodge in Dawson Springs, Kentucky. Just a lodging area, not the not. I didn't build like the cottages, but mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yes. like. The Tinger Rock Forest Lodge. You, you, you do have the lodging area. And the place where you can go fishing. And it's got a little lake. I mean, like the Forest Lodge. And it's got a pool. I didn't build the exact pool, but I did build a pool. I mean, it does have like a camping ground. I mean, the whole entire uh, outdoor retreat pack can be the pink pin file. Here at Forest Lodge, <laughs> we got places to do camping and stuff, and to go hikes. Yeah, you can go hiking in this in this game. So that's something to look forward to. I don't have to go hiking till like the very last day. Okay, Lucky, you're just sitting there talking to you. Talking to yourself. Uh, I want to get to the really, really good stuff, which is probably like in the second, in like in the second day and the third day. That's when the good stuff really starts happening. For real? Huh. I can't tell you what, though. I really can't. Um, I mean, I do remember some that stuff that sounds. happens on the sec, on uh, part 18 and 19, but I can't tell you. I don't want to spoil too much, because then you'll skip this episode and go to the next episode. I know, I know that will happen. I have a feeling that will happen. And then you have uh, Kenny talking to Jenny. I thought if I only built one lodge, just this one lodging area right here, I could have Kenny invite all his family and they stay in this one area. But no, you could only have eight Sims per lot. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? Really? Eight Sims per lot? Floyd I thought you could invite 12 at least, uh, but yeah, only yeah. eight Sims. Ah. Just only eight cents. <laughs> so I had to build, put in two lodges. Good thing I saved this lot. It's in the gallery if you look for custom content. Uh, I had to put it down twice. Because I couldn't fight everybody. Everybody that I wanted to invite to stay in this lodge... I couldn't invite everyone, so I had to put in two lodges, two lodging areas, and have a group of eight here and a group of eight in the other one, staying around the same time. And they and they're across from each other. All I got to do is walk. Oh, I mean, they don't have to walk very far if they want to hang out with each other. Zap them for Bame, Lamina, or Abani. Crimbo. And there's similar. So I placed two lots. The same lot. Like right next to each other. You'll get to see that. 
Flazzle Vilpa, a beamy? Imphalna Seraphi, Kalu Pizoi Brabani. Hanpe, Tibanahanu, us like Jeff and Al. Oh, Quapo. Siglona. New beam. Oh, this Deep is fly. where I uh, found the custom content. So the men have hair. Chest hair. I'm sick of seeing all these grown up Sims. Especially the guy Sims, the middle aged Sims, have no chest hair. That is not realistic at all. They're making them look like. I don't know, like. Why would men have a no hair, chest hair when they're like 40 something years old? If you're 40. Like, 43 years old, you would have chest hair. I'm sick of Sims, you know, 30s, male Sims in 30s and 40s not have chest hair. Or leg hair. Or arm hair. That drop, you can have facial hair, but you can't have arm hair, leg hair, and chest hair. You could in Sims 3. Not in Sims 4. So I had to go through, cut, find custom content. Chest, chest hair, and arm hair, and leg hair. So... Thank goodness the mesh works because I'm worried about my anything I download glitching out. Ah, oh. see, it's right next to each other. But here's the thing: it works like any other lot. If you try to go to the other lot, it would uh, close out and a load, which sucks. It's like, he's just right there. All I gotta do is rock, walk across the lawn. But yeah, I, I cut out the loading screen. I don't want to spend too much time on the loading screen. Uh, Jenny, she, the, the only person Mama. worth spending time with and yeah. one that she could be relatable to in this entire trip is Jenny. Not Jenny. JC. Uh -huh. JC and Jenny are alike. So, oh, yes. as far as traits, and they can be relatable to each other. So, oh, Jenny's like, she's the only, wow. one, in here, only one here we're spending time with because she's, we're, we're a lot alike. We're both mean and jealous and be troublemakers. Yeah. Why well, cook beans and Frank? I would rather either cook hot dogs, steak, or burgers on the grill. But f I didn't know you could cook beans and franks on the grill. Who does that? I can understand, like, corn and kebabs. And... But... I don't see your corn. I wasn't paying attention. Or like the tofu stuff. I get like the tofu hot dogs or the tofu burg. I guess they're veggie burgers. You couldn't really cook beans and franks on the grill, or could you? I had no idea. I mean, we'll have people come over and have some. I mean, uh, I don't want it to go to waste. Uh, you got a big serving, you got a small a serving. I'm just sitting there. Hey. <laughs> you think? I was like, if I wanted to grill something, I would not grill. Beans and Franks would be the last thing on my mind. And it doesn't look like something JC would eat. JC probably eat hot dogs or burgers or steak. Now I would see. Uh, Jenny, if she would grill something, she would grill something vegetarian work because she's vegetarian, like her mom. And I would actually, I didn't give her that, Jenny, that trait. I can see why she eat beans, but not the hot dog part. Because it would have hot dogs on it. She wouldn't eat hot, Jenny wouldn't eat hot dogs, she was vegetarian. Saquinario. Oh, my foof. Oh, kind of yum. Everybody's Shiny. eating. I invited Kenny over. Where the heck is Kenny? Oh, yeah. I invited him over oh. yet. I thought I did for a second. Just a day. A nice hot day. Enjoying some beans and franks. 
It smells so good, apparently. Uh, it's, it's not the only thing I put on the grill. I go with my mom's. You know what thing she, they cook out? Oh, I look forward to going to my mom's. To, especially during the summer. Go with my mom and dad. And they grill some. They always grill something fantastic. Oh, really. Like, like bratwurst and steak and uh, burgers. Oh, and the meat would be so juicy and so tender. Oh, <laughs> I wish I still, I wish I lived near my mom. My mom lives a thousand miles away. Where did the turd come from? Lucky he's got a turd in her um, inventory. Where did she get that from? Lucky, where did you get that from? Where did you get that? Was it left over from Christmas or something? Of course we're here in the summer. Where did you get it? It's like it just popped out of nowhere. It's new. Where'd she get it? Where did you get it? Did somebody give you a bad gift or something? Was Jen... Oh, did Jenny give you a mean gift? Or did JC give you a mean gift? I, I don't understand. Who gave you a mean gift? Because that would be a mean gift. <laughs> Here, grab yourself a serving and sit down and eat it. You like that? You like that, Kenny? I don't know why it shows it's empty in there. It's there's things in there. I mean, it shows it because they didn't have they had knocked on the door to go in. That's the reason why it looks empty. It's not empty. I swear to you, it's not empty. This is the same as the other one. I'm just showing you that. Because <laughs> it looks the same. <laughs> I should have left trash cans out here. I don't think I have. But you can go in and wash dishes, but I didn't put any trash cans anywhere. If cool and soda machines could work, that's also custom content. I wish those would work. That would be awesome. The Samba. Ah, huh? uh -huh. oh, Dada. <laughs> I'll just leave it on the floor. Floor. Just leave it on the ground there, Lucky. Like, it'll be fine. Someone else will just pick it up. And then Kenny answers the conversation. Oh, he picks it up. I'll just let your dad pick it up, Lucky. And where's he going with it? Oh. Hey, I got lucky Mark spending Gold time with her cousin Simon. Cause you know, in my uh, in my story, um, she's really close to her cousin Simon. They live like right around the corner from each other. So yeah, it would make sense if they were close. First, I thought that was Kenny by the by the by the campfire. No, that is uh, Lucky Charles. He's warming. Why would you warm yourself up by the fire? It's hot outside. Doesn't make any sense. Play, play what? Play what? Oh, hot horseshoes. Let's play some horseshoes. I used to play that when I was a kid. Oh, man. It was fun. I used to play horseshoes in my family. Old. And it takes me back to my childhood. Lucky! You would do that. Say excuse me. 
and, and apologize for that. That's that's rude. You just cut cheese and not apologize for it. I know Lucky. Lucky, I know from my story is not rude. Yeah, good job, Nevin. Ooh. Or Naveen, however you pronounce that. Uh -huh. <laughs> there you go, Lucky Charles. You got two Luckies there. Lucky Jefferson, Lucky Jefferson. Except one's a guy and one's a girl. <laughs> yeah, Lucky Charles Jefferson and Lucky Charms Jefferson. If Lucky was a man, it'll be Lucky Charles. And if Lucky Charles was a woman, it'll be Lucky Charms. You see where I'm going with that? That was an okay throw there, Kenny. Just be careful to throw that at somebody's toes. <laughs> Those metal horseshoes. <laughs> you throw that at somebody's toe. <laughs> well... Why'd you stop throwing? Did you throw? There you go. Go lodging. You're already lodging, so what's it? So what are you doing there, Lucky? Oh, I'm, oh, that's where she, that's where she's staying at. Duh. What the heck happened? <laughs> oh, this is where she meets and falls for Wyatt Cannon, which is Matthew Cannon's son. And he's like 30 years old. So <laughs> So so. They flirt with each other a little bit, but when it actually comes to him, she, her coming on to him, being interested, he's kind of skeptical. Because one, he's thirty; two, he's already a father. He's got a kid, and third, well, at this age, she's still sixteen years old. She's not seventeen quite. She didn't turn seventeen till after this happened. So after they get back from the then she's seven then. She's not 16. She's 16, going on 17 during this, during this, during this uh, summer vacation. He's caught, I mean, they flirt with each other. I mean, he's, he's kind of flattered, but he's skeptical. Because she just, he knows she's underage and he doesn't want to get in trouble. But she's going to try anyways. He's not like Lionel. Lionel Prince. Where he thinks age is just a number. Well, she's cloud gazing with him. That's perfectly innocent. I like how the characters they look so flat when they do this. Especially Wyatt. Hey, I wouldn't mind getting a piece of that Native American ass. <laughs> it ain't Wyatt. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> this is supposed to be kid friendly. <laughs> Since when though? Only when my kid is around I can be kid friendly. <laughs> mm. Damn, Wyatt. You got it going on. So is his dad. Oh, I can only, I can, I can say whatever I like about older men because I'm 34. <laughs> yeah.
loving whatever I like. I mean, I can compliment Lisa how Graham. how good uh, older man <laughs> looks in this game because I'm <laughs> I'm kind of middle aged myself. Yeah. Uh, Would you sit um, together and not Lobo. have a fence between you two? Yeah. Shelma Yano. Nala See, he's, he's kind of skeptical. He doesn't understand why she's flirting with him. I mean, he's flattered, oh, but then he's like, huh. uh, I really uh, don't try too hard. <laughs> he's really not in uh, uh, underage girls. Uh, That's not one he, uh, yes. I mean, he's got a kid himself. Guma. It's only Daba ten, but still. News. Yaba with a harfine. Ook. Floy Masharnu. Yarl. Ah, uh, Yoyim. Ah, Nilshaba. Tomba Rimple. Sakwanario of Yazil. Well. Uh. Oh, George. Shobaba. Paris. That's a new. Floyim. Suna. Vashno. <laughs> you could uh, still have a casual Ina. conversation with him, but. He's all for that. But you're not going to get anywhere with him. But she likes him. She's got a big crush on him. Now go hang out with your cousin. Oh, I don't know who's in there. That's a... Um, in the bathroom in there that's uh they're both uh hold on lily would okay the top the boy is wyatt's son cassidy and and then there's lily lily would be chastity's aunt uh-huh Oh, dag, dag. <laughs> since, since Lily Larkin and Wyatt Moosh. are brother and sister. Tip, tip. Yay, boo. Ponka. Pazib. Himna. Pazib. It's like, if she wants to be friends with her father, with, with Wyatt, she's got to be friends with his son. If his son likes her. If Cassidy likes Lucky, then maybe he'll have no problem with her. Being flirty with his father. So if you want to date my father, I guess you'll have to like me first. <laughs> she knows what she's doing. And Kenny, now she tells, she tells someone's had this private discussion with her dad about what he thinks of her dating a 30 year old man. It's like, well, you know him, Dad. I mean, you know him. You're friends with him. So what do you think if we went out? And then uh, Wyatt would go to Kenny and says, daughter is very interested in me. He's like, do you blame her? Nah. He's, he's like, well, do you want to date her? It's like, why? She's, she's underrated. Like, if you do, do you have my permission. Just oh, no. keep when it in your Lola. pants <laughs> until she's 18. Yeah. And it's like, good, because I don't want to, if I do go out with her, I don't want to, I mean, I'm not some kind, Why well, would be like, I'm not some Larva kind of pervert Tarina. or nothing, but <laughs> if I go out with her, I would Harbury, sure, prefer sure. that we Ribbix do take it slow. Phobia. He's like, well, yeah, that's what I'm going with. <laughs> Please take it slow with my daughter. <laughs> oh. Oh. Steve. Oh, yeah, because Lucky was all for the idea that she, you know, by her father, the whole idea with her dating an older man. So how much older? <laughs> it's like, he's only 30. It's like, we'll see, let me talk to him. It's like, really, you're going to have to talk to him? He's like, yes, I'm going to have to talk to him. Nushkuma. <laughs> Some three year old man's gonna be dating my daughter. Under each other, I want to talk to him. I came with a different hairstyle. That's, that hairstyle is custom content. I, I was 
to me. Not into uh, getting Trump custom content. Okay. Well, 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 not, I like well, custom content. Don't well. get me wrong. I only will Red use cus Saquenario. custom content oh, and when I do that buildings. Like, uh, if, yeah, in buildings and furniture. Mostly kitchen, kitchen furniture. TVs, computers, uh -huh. anything building wise. I'm off custom content. <laughs> but very rarely I get clothes that are custom content because some of them have mesh and I, that I don't have and they glitch out. Same with hair. So I still went in ahead and decided to get hair, custom hair and clothes for my sim. Because it's my game. My gosh. It's my game. I may not have my sims uh, be, be able to download because they have custom content. Ah, drawers for Rook. Yips. Yeah, just enjoy yourselves. She's really trying hard. She is really trying. She does get her father's permission, but does Wyatt have Kenny's permission? <laughs> At this point, he's still pretty skeptical. I mean, no woohoo! He'll say no. Not right away. She's still flirt with him. And Jenny is like kind of laughing inside. Thinking she has a hard time. She's like having a hard time containing herself with laughing. Watching her younger sister try very hard to flirt with a man. Grubble <laughs> here. Jenny doesn't like Wyatt. Jenny doesn't Panka. like anybody. She doesn't Panka like anybody. <laughs> you hot? You too hot? Go swimming. I was just going through the number of episodes I have per season. And I thought I had at least 11 episodes for the summer. But it's only 9. <laughs> Shows what I know, right? I can't count, apparently. I wasn't counting, really. I was just guessing. So there's like 13 episodes. No, wait. Um... Yep. Oh. No, there was like twelve episodes for ep for the spring, uh -huh. and nine episodes for the summer. I don't know how many this fall is gonna have, because I I finally got through episode twenty two, uh, uh -huh. because there was skill day. When Thank goodness for skill day, because oh. then I got another episode. So Good after twenty two, I'm stuck. <laughs> Ah, uh, Jenny, quit being rude. You're about to get sent home because you're so rude. But that's the whole point. That's it. That's it, Jenny. Do your homework. At least someone's going to get an A in school. No. Uh -uh. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh. At first, I'm like, well, what? I think they're all stuck. <laughs> I need to reset them. <laughs> Another one, one, one way to reset your Sims when they're stuck is to quickly jump into build mode and then quickly jump out of build mode. 
and into playable mode. Yeah. Go keep, switch instantly from build mode and back to play mode. Because <laughs> that will um, Good job, my get your sims out of this when they're stuck. You know, like, bef- that, that'll that reset them. It does for my sims. Sometimes. Most of the time. It, 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 what? And if they're stuck like that, just looking at each other for no reason, and they're stuck like that for a while, just quickly go into build mode and quickly jump out of it. And they'll be fine. They'll go back to what you told them to do. That's what I have to be doing because they just get stuck. Flirt with them. Hey, <laughs> bold pickup line. Yeah. Oh. She's really trying. She really yeah, wants to go out with this guy. Yeah. <laughs> Their friendship is okay. Their friendship is normal. <laughs> you can send people home. You tell them to go home. Leave me alone. I don't want to talk to you. The nerve Lazamba. The Abasa Zatorb. Pimbus. Ooh. Now he's kind of into it. Okay, he's into it now. Kasana. Don't woohoo. No. No. Who's into that? Get the gnome first. Like, more than one wing. <laughs> Where he's got a kid too, so his kid's his first priority. I guess she's in the men with baggage. Ooh. They don't kiss yet. I'm going to be like, I can't tell you when, but they don't kiss yet. 